Hi YouTube and welcome to Aqua Films. Here I am showing you my three tanks I have set up. Uh, here's my 25 gallon consisting, it's a tropical community. It has guppies, it has red-eyed tetras, it has mollies, it's got neon tetras, it's got the placostomus. Um, that's about it. For, oh, it has an African dwarf frog right up there. Um, I do know that you're not supposed to have two, um, two schools of fish inside of a 25 gallon, which is why I'm going to get a 40 for these and I'm going to complete their school because um, well, the rest of them died off when I first got them, so I'm going to get a 40 gallon um, when I get my paycheck and I'm going to set it up and let it run and I'm going to finish the school. I'm probably going to get a grommy or two. Um, so here's this. I did a new setup for them. I ch It looks kind of like China to me. I put the rocks I got from the Salmon River. I put a lot of plants in there. Of course they're fake, but eventually I do want to get some real plants, possibly some hair grass and some star grass. Uh, so if you have any suggestions on what kind of plants I should get for this tank, let me know. So moving on to my 49 gallon. Here's this one right here. Um, this used to be an Oscar and Convict tank. Unfortunately, my Oscars died because I got two of them from Walmart and one of them from Petco, or PetSmart, and they, the two were infected, and it infected my So they infected my other fish I got from PetSmart, and they all ended up dying, but fortunately I put them in other tanks so that they didn't infect my convicts when I found out. Um, in the beginning stages. So, my convicts are fine. Uh, the Oscars were picking on the convicts anyway. Their fins were getting all torn up. If you can see on his tail, it's all ripped up right there. And my placostomus got all ripped up too. So, um, I guess it wasn't a good idea to put them together anyway. So, I'm going, I've been doing water changes every day um, to keep the water clean since there was an infection in this tank. I want to keep it as healthy as I can. I've just been doing like 10, 15, 25% water changes. Um, but eventually I think I might get a parasitic lid. Let me know what you, could, what you think I should put in this tank down in the comments. And any suggestions will do. I'm obviously going to get a bigger fish tank for them. This isn't going to be their fish tank forever. I'm probably going to get like a 100 gallon or 150 depending on what fish I get. This is just the tank I'm using to grow them up with. Also, I don't know if you've seen my other videos, I used to have a big plant in the back. I decided to take it out so that they had more room to swim. So here's my 39 hexagon. And now for my last tank I have standing for now. There really isn't much going on with this tank right now. I just did an update video, like, what, four days ago or something about it. But I just decided I'd um, include it in this video since it's all my fish tanks I have right now. But, yeah, that's about it for today. I really thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe and comment and like the video. And thanks for watching. Bye.